Ways to Bounce Back from Rejection At some time in our lives, we've all been rejected. It can be painful and take years to recover from. We all want to be liked and appreciated as human beings. Because one of our most essential elements for existence is a sense of belonging to a group, a fear of rejection has naturally developed in our brains. You could be wondering if you're competent enough, if you should keep going, and if you have what it takes to accomplish your goals. All of these emotions are natural. As author Jeb Blunt wrote in his book, Objections, The Ultimate Guide for Mastering the Art and Science of Getting Past No, humans are hardwired to feel pain when we get rejected. And when we feel that pain, Blunt wrote, it triggers fear, whether that's anticipated, perceived, or real. According to Lifehack, we then flog ourselves with self-blame, debilitating guilt, over-accountability, and hopeless thoughts about the future. Romantic rejections are where we tend to be the most vulnerable and left raw to our core. However, it doesn't have to be this way. You can recover. Here are strategies to bounce back from rejection. Remember, you can't lose what you don't have. You may believe that you're a lesser person when you're rejected, but this is not the case. You are still the same person you were before the rejection. You're still a committed professional if you weren't promoted, despite your dedication. You haven't earned anything, but neither have you forfeited anything. As a result, you have two options. You may either be optimistic that they'll eventually recognize your worth and promote you, or you can channel your disappointment into motivation to pursue a new opportunity. Consider rejection as a lesson to reflect on what you can add rather than what you can eliminate. Embrace the anguish without succumbing to it. Many accomplished people either conceal or overindulge when it comes to rejection, which is counterproductive. Allowing oneself to feel pain is the first step in dealing with it. The agony of rejection is an indication that you're mourning the loss of what you wanted. If you ignore the pain, it will simply come back later in a potentially harmful form, such as binge drinking or rage outbursts. Find the confidence to expand your horizons. Rejection might expose places where we haven't yet matured. For example, if you're inclined to self-doubt or have a harsh inner critic who constantly exposes your inadequacies, rejection will exacerbate your feelings of inadequacy. Take advantage of the chance to learn more about the origins of those thoughts. Rejection is one of the most challenging experiences in life, especially if you're accustomed to success. It doesn't have to be a crippling condition. If we have the bravery and humility to look beyond the disappointment of rejection, we'll quickly bounce back from it.